The NBA commissioner Adam Silver had expressed his desire to add an in-season tournament for years. Well, he finally got his wish, and who would have thought that the opening night would have been marred with controversy? The NBA agreed to introduce the first ever in-season tournament during the 2023-2024 season. The NBA has taken elements from the European Soccer League in order to bring more excitement to the regular season. So, what the hell happened on the tournament's first day? Is it all even worth it? Let's catch up with everything and talk about the controversial opening of the in-season tournament. The group stages of the in-season tournament started on Friday night, with a total of 14 teams playing in the group stage games. If you had any trouble figuring out those games or anything special, the loud and unabashed NBA branding on the court is gonna make sure that it doesn't happen again. Talking about the matches, the reigning champions Denver Nuggets played the undefeated Luka Doncic of the Dallas Mavericks. The star-studded duo of Damon Giannis of the Milwaukee Bucks played the mecca of the NBA, the New York Knicks. The other Rookie of the Year candidate, Chet Holmgren of the Oklahoma City Thunders, played the Splash Brothers Stephen Clay of the Golden State Warriors. Before we address the elephant in the room, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to our channel. So it all started in the last 16.4 seconds left of the OKC Warriors game. Lou Dort of OKC tied the game on the line, leaving one last possession for the Warriors to take the game home. Steve Kerr called a timeout and handed the ball to the most reliant scorer on the team, Steph Curry. Curry called the isolation on the perimeter against, who would have thought, Lou Dort himself. Curry waited for a while, as he didn't want to leave any time for an OKC comeback, and as the clock reached less than 5 seconds, the chef went to work. Curry flipped the ball over the 7-foot Chet Holmgren, and it went in with two tenths of a second left. But the controversy started when the refs deemed it as an offensive interference. With the replays from different angles, and according to the rule books, the basket was still awarded to the Warriors, but the damage had already been done. The highest scoring game of the opening night of the in-season tournament ended on a controversial ref call. The semifinal and championship games will be held at T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas, where players will play for the newly introduced NBA Cup and $500,000 per player for the winning team. Each in-season tournament game, other than the championship game, will be considered a regular season game. Players will also be eligible to win the in-season tournament MVP award and make the all-tournament team, as if the teams needed another motivation for playing hard. But sometimes playing may not be successful, like the Dame Giannis duo. Check out if the Damian Lillard and Giannis Antetokounmpo are destined to fail.